Hello everyone, I am teacher Edna and welcome to another lesson of grade 6 science. Are you ready? Let's get started. Our lesson for today is all about the digestive system. The digestive system consists of the mouth, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, rectum, and anus. And also, the accessory organs include the salivary glands, gallbladder, liver, and pancreas. The process of breaking up of food is called digestion. Here are the parts of the digestive system. The mouth, esophagus, the liver, stomach, pancreas, small intestine, large intestine, rectum, and anus. Digestion begins in the mouth. Inside the mouth are the tongue and the teeth. The teeth cut the food into small pieces and the tongue helps the food movement in the mouth while chewing. The tongue also helps us push the food into the esophagus when swallowing. When chewing, the food is softened and moistened by the saliva from the salivary glands. Saliva contains an enzyme that digests starch. Esophagus It is a long tube about 25 to 30 cm long, where the food passes. The food is squeezed and pushes down from the mouth with the help of the tongue through the esophagus. Stomach. It is a stretchable hollow muscular bag. It produces gastric juices that help in the mixing and breaking the food further. Small intestine. It is where the final digestion happens. The small intestine is a narrow folded tube about 2.5 cm wide and 7 meters long. The liver. It produces bile which goes through the gallbladder. It is the largest gland in the body. Bile helps digest fats. Pancreas. It is an organ that produces pancreatic juices that digest carbohydrates, fats, and proteins. The large intestine. It is a large coiled tube attached to the small intestine. It is where the digested food is temporarily stored. It reabsorbs most of the water and minerals. And the rectum. It is the passage of undigested food from the large intestine. The anus. It is an opening where waste comes out of body. This elimination of body waste is called defecation or bowel movement. Those are the parts of the digestive system. Did you learn something today? Let us check your understanding. Multiple choice. Direction. Read each item carefully. Choose the letter of the correct answer. Number one. What do we call the process of breaking up of food? What do we call the process of breaking up of food? A. Digestion B. Elimination 
C. Respiration D. Circulation The answer is letter A. Number 2. What part of the digestive system receives the food? What part of the digestive system receives the food? A. Esophagus B. Mouth C. Stomach D. Anus The answer is letter B. Number 3. It is a long folded narrow tube where the final digestion happens. It is a long folded narrow tube where the final digestion happens. A. Esophagus B. Rectum C. Small intestine D. Large intestine The answer is letter C. Number 4. Where does the digested food store temporarily? Where does the digested food store temporarily? A. Mouth B. Stomach C. Large intestine D. Liver The answer is letter C. Number 5. What do we call the elimination of body waste? What do we call the elimination of body waste? A. Digestion B. Respiration C. Peristalsis and D. Bowel movement Answer is letter D. How's your score, kids? I hope you did a great job today. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Miss Dafia, and click the notification bell for more educational videos. Bye!